everybody, welcome to my Minecraft server. I'm going to show you how to build a house out of dirt. Well, I have two interests in my life currently, and one of them is witchcraft, which I am absolutely exhausted from because of uh, my recent expenditures due to my thesis. And the other is Minecraft, and I guess D&D, &D. but those three things are really the only things that keep me sane and on the planet, and debatably sane. But anyway, I had this idea for a while. I have like one popular post on Tumblr ever, and of course, it's about those two things, witchcraft and Minecraft, and how they both end in craft. I'm hilarious. So, I thought today's video would be really fun if we did witchcraft in Minecraft. Because sometimes, you know, you just, you don't want to go outside, you, you're in bed, ill, and but you know, you like want to get your witch on, so uh, we're gonna play some Minecraft today and see what we can do uh, witchcraft-wise. And uh, you can tell uh, there's all my worlds. I have made a lot of worlds in my day, alas. Here we go. Let the party begin. So we're gonna go to sleep. And I'm surprised that it let me sleep uh, when there's zombies right next to me, but it did. All right. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. This is probably gonna be just like 15 minutes of Rachel running away from zombies. Okay. This. Oh God. There's a fucking creeper by my house. Well, that's that's no good. All right. Um, that simply won't do. I want to show you guys this really cool village that actually did spawn here. Um, and I just kind of amped it up a little bit with my supreme decorating skills. So I have this little village and it spawned like right next to a giant mushroom. That's a lie I made that, but because it was so close to like this roofed forest, I thought it'd be really cool if I like amped it up and made it all mushroom themed. So I made some houses out of mushroom blocks and um, added more giant mushrooms, which I think really gives it some character, you know? Um, and I made a lot of villagers in here. I just spawned in a ton of them and kind of set them all loose. All right, but this is not what we're here for. We're here for the witchcraft, so we're gonna start doing that. So the first thing that I wanna do is leave an offering to the Fey Lords of this forest. So we are gonna go to my house and we're not gonna piss off the creeper. Shh, I'm gonna fight him, I'm gonna fight him. This is probably a very bad idea. Water battle. <laughs> oh no, that was a bad idea. Okay, well, look, he didn't explode anything. Maybe that was a good idea after all. All right, what should I leave as an offering to the Fae? I think they definitely want the most expensive thing that I have, so I think we have to give them some of my emeralds. All right, I think also they'd really like some beets. Give me my beets, my little Russian lady. So, um. We're gonna give them some beets and uh, feathers too, I think, cause uh, I think that the Fae would like feathers. Oh, we could give mushroom stew to the Fae too. Why do I need to eat when I have my mysterious Fae Lords to keep me company? Opening the door with my beets, okay. So I'm gonna run into this forest because it's a very holy place. As you can see, I've made some stairs here and I have a little shrine that I did make a while ago. Uh, oh, it's down here. Okay, so I have this little shrine going and I was gonna dedicate this space. I was gonna make a statue of Hozier and this was gonna be like my altar to him. Um, so maybe that's something we should do today as well. Okay, first we're gonna leave our offering to Hozier. Um, and the other Fae Lords that exist. So anyways, we're gonna come over here and we're gonna dig this little hole and we're gonna deposit, not the dirt, we're not gonna deposit the dirt. That is not acceptable for our Fae Lords. We're gonna deposit our offerings. Then we're just gonna close up that hole. Now we've successfully buried our first offering in Minecraft. All right. Um, Oh no, that didn't work. It just had me collect them again. We have not successfully buried our first offering in Minecraft. Maybe if we dig deeper. All right, let's try this again. 
I'm gonna throw them down. Then we're just gonna close up that hole. Fuck. We're gonna dig down. Gonna dig down. We're gonna throw our emeralds in. Go. We're gonna throw our emeralds in. Then we're gonna seal up the hole. We're gonna seal up the hole. No! Third time's the charm. We're gonna seal up the hole. Oh, I know what we're gonna do. We're just gonna, yeah, there we go, buddy. Yes, we just don't fill that hole. So, if you wanna leave an offering in Minecraft, don't fill the hole that you put your offering in. Pick it, do, do the one above it, so then it just, just stays there. Boom, gone. All right, let's go do the next one. Let's just do by this little pond right here. Oh, that pond would be good. It's farther away from the other one. Let's, let's dig like right here. So dig two down and then deposit. Uh, we're gonna give this one stew. I throw that down in there like so. Boom, expert witchcraft. All right, let's keep going. Ah, no, okay. Let's keep witching. Ooh, we could like pick flowers and give the flowers to the fae too. Let's do that. All right, who deserves the beetroots? Where should we leave the beetroots? Let's leave them by the sheep. He will not be tempted to eat our offering. He probably will, but he won't. I'm gonna throw in all 11 beetroots because I like to live my life on the edge. Hell yeah, all right. Hi, Mr. Sheep. I'm, so oh wow, I feel bad for punching animals. Now, I don't know why I did that. La 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 la. La 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 la. Where are we gonna leave the feathers? Ooh, whoa. This looks like an actual fairy ring. I mean, it's not mushrooms, but does anyone else see this? All right, we're not gonna step through that. We're just gonna leave uh, two offerings here, not disturbing it. Um, we're gonna throw down, cause I'm very afraid now. Um, we're gonna throw down the lilac and we're gonna throw down all 15 feathers because this has struck it. This has struck the fear of God in me. I'm shooketh. Okay. Um, oh God, the sun is going down. We need to sleep. You can't do your witchcraft if you don't get your eight hours of sleep every night. Dad, now we have to wait for the sun to set. So I'm just gonna jump around the house. Full-time buffoonery. You can only get it here, folks. So this is my actual house, not the fortress that I had over there, and it's full of nothing. I haven't really decorated it yet. It was gonna be really cool. This is where um, me and Hozier were gonna live. I really did not mean to be as obsessed with Hozier as I am, and it really wasn't gonna be a shrine to Hozier, and then it was. Cause I never got to live out my um, childhood fantasies of making a shrine of a celebrity like you see on cartoons. So I decided to do that now because I'm weird. Let's take, ooh, these will, this is nether brick fence because I cheated. I haven't gone to the nether in this game. I like alternate between doing things in creative to get things that I want and then doing um, survival because I, I just roll like that. Okay, um, what are we gonna use for Hozier's face? Uh, we're just gonna use a carved pumpkin because why not? All right, this feels like cheating so we're gonna go back to survival because sometimes I like to play by the rules. Only conditionally. Okay. Uh, no, that doesn't look good. He needs arms. Well, there's Hozier. We'll get him some arms someday, somehow. He needs like a hat or something. He's got very long, luxurious hair, I know that. Um, we'll work on that. I think we'll leave some bones because he has that song about like decomposing with your love. So we're gonna um, leave Hozier some bones. Oh, I think I had the chest here to put offerings in. 
oh well, that will just be where that is. I wanna show you something else. All right, we're gonna, there's one more thing that we can do. I have another village. Now this one I did artificially make um, in this ravine because it was close to the other village and I thought it would be really cool. Um, cause there was a farm, that's how it started, and I was like, what if I put a, an entire village in this ravine? So I've been working on that, again, I just spawned a shit ton of villagers to just live in this ravine. Uh, so that's pretty cool, and it continues on that way, but we are going to my base that's down here. Uh, so this is my ravine base. It's pretty cool. It's missing a gate for some reason, so that's a new development. So... Clearly, this is the way that you're supposed to do witchcraft in Minecraft. This is not the way that we will ever do it. Fuck this. Fuck this thing in particular. Uh, yeah, I don't know what else to do, but I really hope you enjoyed, um, my Minecraft. <laughs> what do I have down here? <laughs> A bedrock! Oh, this is another thing that I, um, made. That isn't, um, I wanted to make like a giant walkway that just looks down into the void. Because I thought that would be pretty cool. So that's another uh, witchcraft time. Do we're going to do one last witchcraft thing. Hold on to your horses. Things are about to get crazy. All right, we're going to do this. Oh god, I thought that was another person for a second. <laughs> back here to the lava walk and we're just gonna surrender ourselves to the void I think that would be a great way to end this video goodbye and we're back to life because that's what happens in Minecraft all right uh, I think that this video is now entirely too long, so thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you want to see more of me doing witchcraft in Minecraft, uh, make sure you let me know. I love hearing from you guys. I definitely am taking suggestions at the moment, because like most things in my life, I have no idea what I'm doing. I do a cute like outro with a little Minecraft person waving at you, but I also don't know how to change perspective. Is it like any one of these buttons? No. Is it? No, no, no. Oh no, that opened iTunes. Almost always when I hit the play button on my computer, I do not want to open iTunes. Sometimes I want to open Spotify, but I definitely never want to open iTunes and listen to U2's Every Breaking Wave. This is copyrighted music and I can't let this play. <laughs> Alright guys, uh, that's about all I have for you today. Uh, ha have a great day. Peace out. Stay crafty. Oh my god. Why do I do these things to myself? <laughs>